Hello, my name is Remy Dairo. The world is going through a challenging time right now. The globe is going through a very, very tough time. And many countries are looking for a way to come out or contain you know, this challenge that we have at hand. And what is that? The coronavirus. And some will call it COVID-19. As a result of this, many countries have shut down you know, businesses, work, and a lot of things are, you know, um, life stopping, so to say, uh, where few countries are on a partial lockdown. So the question many people are asking me today is, how can I be productive in this COVID-19 compulsory break? So I'm at home, I'm shut down, compulsory shut down. So the question is, how can I make my time valuable? How can I be more productive even while I'm at home? Here are five things you can do or you may need to consider to increase your productivity in this tough time. So I have a topic this day, I might call it how to be productive during COVID-19 compulsory break. How to be productive during COVID-19 compulsory break. Number one, work from home using productivity tools. Work from home using productivity tools. There are a lot of productivity tools in your on your laptop, in your phones, apps all over the places that can use to increase your productivity. Like Slack, Google Hangout, Evernote, 24May, WhatsApp video or audio, WhatsApp group, webinar, and a lot of them are out there. So if you check online, there are many apps, productivity apps that can increase your productivity. You can have a short meeting with your you know, team. You can have a strategic meeting. You can communicate with your customers. You can even solve you know, problems through those apps. So the question is, are you using productivity tools? Number two, read those books, either PDF or hard copies. Those books you have promised yourself, you said, you said you're going to read a long time. This is the time to read them. You've promised yourself, say, I'm going to read this book. Oh, I'm very busy. Now you are not as busy as you are. You are not doing this, um, the seven to, uh, you know, um, eight, uh, five, as the case may be. You are not rushing out in the morning anymore, coming back late in the night. You have, uh, I mean, good time for yourself. Read those books. So you're going to change your life. What are the skills that you are lacking? What are the knowledge you are lacking presently? Then look for the book that, you know, answers those questions. It will definitely increase your productivity. Number three. Make those calls and send those messages to those people you had wanted to send it to. Very funny, right? Make those calls or send those messages to the people you had wanted to send messages to over the years. So you have been saying, oh, I would have loved to call this my friend. I would have loved to send this message to my, uh, this customer. I would have loved to get in touch with this person. This is the time to do it. Pick your phone this time. Write out the names of who you need to have called. Call them. Communicate with people. Connect with people. Some are, some are going through stuff. Some might need just to hear your voice again. Connect with them. You might be surprised. Somebody's life might turn around just because you you, know, you just you know given a call. So I, I I advise you to do this. Make that call and send those messages. Number four, write those books or articles. I have said you do. Write those books or articles that you said you want to do. So, before you are saying, oh, if I have enough time, I would love to write this my book. Oh, there's this book I wanted to write a long time. Oh, there's this article I'm working on. Now is the time to sit down and write the book. You'll be surprised that at the end of COVID-19 compulsory break, you must have been an author. You must have, you know, become a, a best-selling author. Why? Because you use the time very well. So, the question is, how profit, uh, how, how value-adding are you using this time for? So don't let it just slip away. Use the time writing your books, writing those articles to definitely increase your productivity. Finally, number five, fight for your me time. Fight for your me time. Your me time is the time that you are alone. When you are thinking, you are evaluating and re-evaluating about your life. You are thinking, how close are you to your, uh, to your dreams? How close are you to your vision or to, to your dreams or to, to your objectives or to your goals? So the question is, do you even have that me time at all? So before you have been saying, I've been so busy, that's why people have been encroaching into my time. Now you can shut down, close the door in the room, you know, play classical music and begin to think about your life. How progressive are you? How, how, how are you getting close to what you thought about a few years ago or even at the beginning of this year? So the question is, do you have enough me time?
So, with these few points I've shared with you, I'm sure you are able to find the reason to use this COVID-19 compulsory break to be more productive rather than just chatting or just, you know, broadcasting, uh, well, I mean, uh, gossiping all over the places without knowing that this time can be a value adding to you. So I challenge you, use your time well. You will be productive. See you at the top. My name is Remedy Aaron once again. Follow me on my YouTube and on my, all my social media platforms to get more valuable content like this. Have a great day.